On 4th February, the House summoned the Minister of Education, Janet Museveni, to explain the low education curriculum. The legislators had blocked the start of the syllabus on grounds that it had been rushed with inadequate resources and training of the implementers. Today the minister was in the house to present a statement on the matter. In her statement, Janet Museveni explained to the house that on the advice of cabinet, government had resolved that it could not halt the implementation of the curriculum as the ministry had the capacity and resources to roll it out. Cabinet being the policy-making organ of government, we had to consult cabinet first and we were guided as follows. One, that we should not hold the rollout because it was too late to change that plan. Cabinet, after listening to her, was convinced that indeed the government had not only the will but also the capacity and the readiness to roll out the new program. And therefore, as the minister... However, several opposition MPs rose to oppose the minister's statement with some calling it outright defiancy of the House. So before we even discuss this statement, under Rule 50, Madam Speaker, I would like to seek your guidance. What happens to the resolution of this House that was taken and passed validly? Is for the Minister to come here and explain the steps taken in implementation of a parliamentary resolution. Not in regurgitating content that was presented here by the Minister of State for Primary Education. But these MPs were overruled by Speaker, who cleared the way for the unveiling of the new curriculum. The Minister of State for Education had already indicated that they are going to come here with a comprehensive answer. So this is what they have done. Hubbard Ziwa, NTV at Parliament.